Hello and welcome back to the Vietnamese language online class. Sorry for having out like half a year because I've been busy with the Vietnamese rap that I made. And you can check them out in my uh, other account, The Prince of Rap 92, on YouTube. So now let's review some of the stuff that we went over last time. Do you remember what Bạn Khỏe Không is? Bạn Khỏe Không? Bạn Khỏe Không? How do you answer it? I just want to know the answer. So yeah, you can answer by saying Tôi Khỏe or Tôi Không Khỏe um, be Because you know that Bạn Khỏe Không means how are you? And Tôi Khỏe means I'm fine. So you would say that. And Tôi Không Khỏe means I'm not feeling well. Alright. Let's go on to new stuff. Um, to say long time no see would say lâu rồi không gặp in Vietnamese. Lâu rồi không gặp. Repeat. Lâu rồi không gặp. Alright, so to acknowledge that fact that uh, you haven't seen each other for a long time, you would say vâng meaning yes. The difference between có meaning yes that we learned last time in the last lesson is that có is used in idioms or sentences with the word có in a question. Like, bạn có khỏe không? It's the same thing as saying bạn khỏe không? And vâng is used for, you know, general, general saying and có, you can use the có to answer the question bạn có khỏe không? Alright, let's move on with some new vocabularies and uh, just don't get intimidated by the, by the list because I'm just gonna read through it and then we're gonna go over it later so for parents we're gonna use the word cha mẹ repeat cha mẹ for older brother, we're gonna say anh, anh. For older sister, we're gonna say chị, chị. For older, I mean younger brother or sister, I make a mistake here, is em for a younger brother or sister, em. And tired is mad mad sick is bận bận but is nhưng nhưng của bạn meaning your của bạn của bạn my means của tôi của tôi so for parents, we're gonna say cha mẹ, meaning parents. Repeat cha mẹ with cha being father and mẹ being mother. Repeat cha cha mẹ mẹ. And for you know siblings, we're gonna say an. G M meaning brother, sister, and younger sister or brother. Here, I'll make a mistake again. I'm sorry for that, but yeah. So, repeat. An, an, G, G, M, M, with M being younger sister or brother, not older. And um, the word for tired is mad. Repeat, mad, mad. And sick is bang, bang. And they say, but we say nhưng của bạn is your của bạn. Repeat, của bạn. My is 
của tôi của tôi 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 so now I'm gonna show you how to say how are your parents first how do you say how are you yeah if you say bạn khỏe không it is correct so now what's the words for parents it's cha mẹ and um what is the word for your or it's của bạn and so how do you say the whole sentence is cha mẹ của bạn có khỏe không cha mẹ của bạn có khỏe không you see how easy it is if you merge words into a sentence yeah alright how do you say my mom is tired what is the word for my mom mom is mẹ and của tôi is my so you have my my mom we, we, we don't really say my mom in Vietnamese we say mom my it's kind of weird right but that's how we say it so how do you say tired it's mad mad and we don't use to be in Vietnamese so how do you say the whole sentence and do you remember what the word for older brother is? It's ang, ang, ang. And what's the word for younger sister or brother? Alright, it's am, am. So what is Của bạn mean Của bạn Is your Alright, repeat Của bạn Của bạn And what does this word mean? Bạn Bạn Yeah, it means sick Bạn Bạn And what about this word? Mad Mad Tired Mad Mad And what's the word for older sister? It's chị 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 Alright, so now let's have a little chat um, I'ma tell you what to answer I'ma read you the question first, okay? Uh, cha mẹ của bạn có khỏe không? What does it mean? How how are your parents? And you have to reply with they're good. Cha mẹ của tôi khỏe. Cha mẹ của tôi khỏe. Cha mẹ của tôi khỏe. Còn anh chị của bạn thì sao? What about your um, siblings? So you have to answer with My brother and sister are good But my little brother is sick Anh chị tôi khỏe Nhưng em tôi bệnh Anh chị tôi khỏe Nhưng em tôi bệnh Alright, so we reach the end of the road So I congratulate you on completing the lesson today but I'm, I'm really sorry because um, I haven't been updating anything yet but you know more videos coming on the way so just wait okay don't be impatient all right see you later Hãy subscribe